after this webinar on how you can access and activate your courses on the websites. So um, let's proceed now. I hope that my screen is clear to you. So this is it, the TASO certification course, K-12. Um, basically, the word K-12 is um, currently now attached to some of the international certifications because as we all know, um, K-12 is the, the international standards. So let's proceed. So about the course. Now, what is this course all about? So the um, this course, uh, this course is um, sponsored by Tassel Foundation, and it is on platform by Canada. So, what is the description of the course? I'm going to give you an explanation on this. So, Tassel Foundation program is designed for the students that are willing to become language teachers and for the experienced teachers that are hoping to upgrade their skills the program covers grammar structure um, conversation activities methodologies pedagogical skills um, class management class ecology um, updated technology in the classroom online medium education social media instructions and much more so participants can enroll free but to be certified through TASO Canada, some fees may apply. For the best results, enjoy the materials, complete all assignments, engage in group discussions, participate in the final exams, and keep up with the schedule. So what is this all about? So um, this um, TASO certification is from TASO Foundation. So TASO Foundation has a tie up with, um, tie up with um, TASO Canada. So basically, also saying here, if you wanted to become an accredited um, or certified TESOL Canada grad, um, you may use this free um, course to to upgrade to upgrade to their courses. Um, TESOL Canada offers a different um, courses, and you can um, use this as the foundation. So basically, after the course, you will have a certification um, from TESOL Foundation, imprinted also the name of TESOL Canada in there. So TESOL Canada will give you an E-TESOL um, attested certificate. It means to say that TESOL Canada is um, testifying that you finish the course under the TESOL Foundation program. Okay. So um, in this um, course, um, you, there are a lot of materials that you will cover. Um, there are also assignments. There are also group discussions. And you also have exams to, to accomplish. As you remember, I am also enrolled in this program. And um, weeks ago, I posted the webinar training of ESO Canada. And this is actually the program that they are um, actually in line with. So if you um, attended the ESO Canada um, webinar that time, it's part of the um, group discussions and the webinar. So basically, when you enroll here in this course, you will receive a webinar from TESOL Canada. Okay, so let's proceed. So what is the objective of this um, TESOL certification? So TESOL Foundation Program prepares participants to receive their TESOL certification. Okay, so we have some questions here. On TESOL certification and start a real-world teaching practice. So upon successful completion of the TESOL Foundation program, students will have gained proficiency in teaching general English to adults in recreational and social settings, um, such as language schools, and will be prepared to move to an advanced TESOL to teach Academy English or TAE and classes and to teach English to children or TEC. Okay, there's also people on the waiting room, I can accept them. Okay. So what are the requirements? Okay, okay, hello. Good evening, Miss Vinley. Okay, so so what is uh, what are the requirements in order for you to um, to get in the course? Okay, so the first requirement is a bachelor's degree is required. So but mature students may be accepted with high school diploma. Um, Non-native speakers must demonstrate their fluency through successful results in IELTS. TOEFL or TELPE uh, -E and TESOL English 
language proficiency exam free online. So, um, for example, you wanted to activate the course tonight. Are you going to have this type of exams? The answer is no, basically no. So the main reason why they um, add this requirement is because, as I've told you, this is actually a foundation course. So if you wanted to study a more advanced um, TESOL certifications under TESOL Canada, this is actually their requirements. So, okay. So to make clear things up, you are studying under TESOL Foundation Program, sponsored and platformed by TESOL Canada. If you wanted to make, a, a, you know, um, an upgraded TESOL certifications, you will directly study to TESOL Canada and they will accept you with this um, requirements. Okay, so who are the target audience? Okay, this program is, is excellent for individuals willing to start a teaching career, um, changing professions, and even um, existing teachers that wish to update their teaching skills. Um, if you like to teach abroad or in USA and Canada, teaching to immigrants and foreign students, um, this program is for you. Okay, so so that's what TESOL, this TESOL certification is all about. Now, so who are the instructor? So those individuals who attended the TESOL Canada webinar um, a weeks ago, weeks ago, um, he is the the resource speaker. Yeah, so our resource speaker or the the course instructor is Chavez Validazi, um, Validazi, okay, he is a PhD and EDU. Um, he is the, the CEO and the president of TESOL Canada. So TESOL Canada introduces the most advanced teaching standards to ESL teachers aiming to teach the English language in Canada, USA, and the overseas. Our mission is to establish teaching standards an education equilibrium among thousands of colleges, language, schools, and teachers worldwide. Um, providing a TESOL foundation free of charge would enable millions of teachers to access TESOL Canada resources and standards that could benefit their um, students globally. So this course is also a great opportunity for new teachers to learn TESOL and obtain their certifications. So basically, what the CEO has said, it's actually free and you don't need to pay anything. Okay, it's actually free of charge. Yeah, so I'm actually um, seeing some questions here, but um, the chat box is not popping out. I actually don't know why. Okay, but I will just, if you have any questions, you can just um, message just on the chat box and I will try to, um, to answer this um, after the presentation. Okay, so now let's proceed with the course activation. So the course activation is actually very easy. So here is it. Okay, so the first step, okay, the first step that you need to do is you have to visit um, www.canvas.net. So Canvas is actually an um, educational site where all your studies in, in Tesla Canada will happen. So the first step is you need to visit the website. So after you visit the website, let me put my video here. After you visit the website, the, the second step that you need to do is you have to search the word TESOL on the search engine. Same on, the, on this picture. And you will see the course below. Okay, search the word TESOL and then you will see here there's only one TESOL program in Canvas, and that's the TESOL certification program. That's the K-12 HE under TESOL Canada. Okay, then step three, what you need to do in step three is that you have to click the course and enroll in the program. This is the picture. You will see here um, the word enroll and the, the course date, the duration, the commitment time, the requirement and the course type and the credentials. So if you will see on the credentials, there's um, there's a word badge certificate, it's paid. It's actually paid by Tesla Foundation. So after you um, you click the word enroll in the middle of the picture, um, in you will be diverted in this page. So you have to input your full name and your email address. You have to tick the small box saying that you agree in the terms and conditions 